Hey, it's Sound from Tom's Tunes. I'm here with this 2004 Tahoe, slightly neglected, but we're gonna bring it right back up to modern speed. This boat's getting new railings, new deck boards, new vinyl flooring. About the only thing that's gonna stay are the pontoons. This rub rail is in good shape. The corner caps are in good shape. Uh, everything else is going on it. You take a peek just from the outside. This is what happens when a boat is uncovered. It's exposed to the elements. We get the, the wear pattern on the carpet where people are constantly walking. We get the moss on the outside. Again, this boat has risers to hopefully let air in and out and dry out the carpet, but it just can't keep up. This carpet is too plush. It just held too much moisture for too long. Let's go inside and look at these seats and the layout. These seats, they're a modern style seat. We've got a lean back, we've got a wide radius corner, but as you can see, the sun got to the vinyl, some critters got to the foam. These are falling apart. These pretty much go into the dump at this point. Not much we can do with these. Now they don't even have a plastic bottom. They just have aluminum bases. So not worth recovering. These unfortunately got to go to the dump. If you come in, you can see what color the carpet was at one point. So before it got all stained and everything, this for some reason, this carpet's in much better shape. We're gonna stick with a similar layout. A couple seats up front, lean back into an L couch in the back, we'll have a table and a sun deck. We'll have a stern entry door as well. It's getting a new console, standard console. So that will be going on here, new captain's chair. Everything's gonna be different, heavy duty bimini. But we gotta start first by tearing it apart, get it down to the bare aluminum so we can put new deck boards on, that vinyl. Then we get to the fun stuff of decorating it out with new seats and everything else. So all of our original steering controls, ignition stuff, is all run here from the back. We're gonna go ahead, we already ran our wiring harness from pontoon stuff. So my plug-in for the dash is there. We run the power leads, which is a big red, that's the power supply, big ground to the battery. There's an orange and brown, that's a live well, and then this gray and blue is a stern light or anchor light up on the bimini, and then a small ground that goes back with our bimini light so that's run back and then forward runs right here as it goes forward there's one big ground that's going to split up front we have a gray with a green stripe that's your navigation lights there are running lights up front and then black with a gray that's our docking lights this orange with a white is a horn if we come up front so everything comes up and it splits here this short side is going to stay on the starboard side of the boat the other side runs across to the port side and will be wired in for those lights. And like I said, our ground splits so that everybody gets a ground. So kind of complicated looking, but really not that bad when you sort it out and you lay everything out, especially before we put the deck on. We're going to get to decking and vinyling this one right now. We are getting to where we are unboxing. We've got a whole stack, this whole stack. And I've already unboxed a bit. Our sun deck is here, which is using the same vinyl from pontoonstuff.com. I just take it to a local upholster and he makes me the sun deck. I like to go ahead and I've cut out my speaker holes in the corner seats where speakers are going in the side of the console. And we'll get to the whole console. We've done a whole video where we do the entire console before installing it on the boat. This will be no exception, this is, that's exactly how we'll do this one. Steering, gauge, switch panel, everything that's getting. This one will actually have a binnacle control mounted up on the side here. So we'll do all of that before we mount it up on the boat. Just makes it easier and the mess that's down here is a lot easier to clean up on the floor than it is in the boat amongst all the brand new things. Moving right along, today is the unbox and get situated day. Eh? 